Okay, this is another bathroom that we've done. Um, it was pretty cool because uh, this was the garden tub over here um, where this uh, shower is now. And uh, we built this little knee wall here to kind of cap off the end. And then um, this is where the shower was, uh, was over in this area. So we um, got that to be a nice linen closet and we kind of set it back in there a little bit um, so that when you're opening up the bifold that will go there, uh, you're not messing with where the toilet area is. Um, these are run on a diagonal. They're 12 by 12 um, tiles. They look really neat. Um, they kind of look like um, uh, marble. Um, whole new baseboard everywhere, custom, custom trim. Um, even around their bull nosed um, corner edging, we, we made all of that custom as well. Um, we brought the drywall flush with the edge of the bull nose and the, um, and the wall cap here. Um, we ran the 12 by 24 versions of that floor tile and the brick pattern on the wall and the shower in here with this cool little deco strip that uh, has a glass and a um, little stone accent to it. Um, in the uh, inside of the shower, uh, this is called morning mist um, granite, but we ran it on the bench and inside of the double niches. So basically when you're sitting in the shower, you can access your stuff there. And uh, they probably will end up putting a little hook or something right here and have a squeegee or a loofah or something right there in the middle. But, um, and then again down onto the floor with the, the two by twos. Um, this is a, one of the hair trap drains um, that, that you see in all of our videos and I'll just demonstrate it for you. Um, so basically you put this key in there and as you turn the key it brings the piece up and you can see it catches all of the debris. So you take it and you clean the debris off. Okay, which would be your hair. Put it back in there. Now you have a nice clean uh, drain to let the water flow freely again. Um, so then you just unscrew the P and just pop the drain back in. Simple as that. Um, so uh, we ran the morning mist on the curb as well. Um, and inside of this morning mist, you can pick up the, the cherry as long as well as the grays and the stuff that's in the tile here but um, the cherry is really accented by the cherry in the in the cabinets down here which are uh, custom cabinets that uh, you don't see this kind of stuff every day um, double fluted on the sides beautiful detail in the in the doors um, you can you can see how uh, most people would run scribe mold over here up against the wall, but not us. Um, these are full extension uh, all the way out. Um, they are dovetail construction, which means the you can see the edge of the drawer full on wood, and they are soft close as well. Um, just really nice, beautiful cabinets. We put the rosette at the top just to kind of cap it off but um, so this is another shower and building contracting and uh, just a cool way to, to kind of turn your bathroom into a little oasis um, we ran the bulldoze around the window um, to kind of not accentuate it but let it blend into the pattern and, and we decided not to go with the granite in there because we thought it'd be too much and kind of draw attention to it and we didn't want to. So um, that is uh, another uh, design thing in here with the, a lot going on. Oh, this is the Delta Intuition faucet. It's very popular amongst my customers. You just take it and twist it out and you can have the wand going so you can clean everything or you can have this rain shower going uh, or you can just have them both going at the same time. And that is determined by this guy here. Uh, when it's like that, it's going out of the rain shower in there. In the middle, it's both. 
uh, I mean, the top is just the rain shower, middle is both, and then the bottom is, is just the shade of rain head, and then, uh, or the wand. And then this one determines uh, which set of nozzles on the wand it's going to come out of, uh, be it the middle, these, or that. So um, it's pretty cool when it has the matching um, finish to the rest of the bathroom as well. So uh, we're just waiting on countertops and and uh, we'll be ready to go. So there it is, um, another beautiful bathroom.